struggling artist offers room for rent. The Airbnb listing says it's decorated in a post-impressionist style, reminiscent of southern France and times gone by. If the room looks familiar, that's because this is a faithful copy of master painter Vincent van Gogh's bedroom in his beloved yellow house. We really wanted to bring the bedroom alive and we wanted to bring the man alive. We wanted to show that he was someone who lived in a real place in Arles at a specific time. Art lovers, for the princely sum of $10, get the chance to spend one night in the one-bedroom replica. I think the life of Van Gogh is so well known, you can't separate it from the artist. And the idea of staying in his bedroom where he slept, where he painted, is very, very moving. The Art Institute of Chicago hit on this novel way to highlight their newest exhibit, featuring paintings of Van Gogh's famous bedroom. This exhibit helped me to see him outside of being a painter. I've seen Van Gogh exhibits over the years, but this one really tapped into his being as a person. In, during some of the show, I found myself getting a little bit tearful. It's the first time the three bedroom pieces have been exhibited together in North America. Of which ours is the second one, painted a year after the first one, not in Arles, where he lived and where the bedroom was, but rather in the hospital, in the asylum where he was institutionalized. The replica bedroom, designed by the Institute and found in Chicago's River North neighborhood, is listed on Airbnb as if the artist himself were renting it for cash to buy paint. A museum spokeswoman says February dates for the apartment filled within minutes of the promotion being announced. More vacancies will be announced by the Institute at a later date. Tracy Brown, Associated Press.